YouTubers. This is Robbie 1989 Zero. Here with Super Thomas Moore, and we're gonna show you some tools that you, you can use to take apart a BMX bike. Got it. Here we have a 5H wrench, a pair of vice grips, flat screwdriver, a smaller flat screwdriver. For your optional use, a hammer. Some alley keys, very important. An adjustable wrench, another good item to have. Certain size of wires. So these are some of the tools you can use. So you have a few choices here. The screwdrivers you can use. Some people like using a longer one, some people like using a longer one. So next, next we're going to show you the bike frame we're going to use. This is the one we're going to put parts on. It's not a, it's not a big frame. It's just, like a, it's, just, kid, I would say. it's just a frame we found that we decided to put the parts on it just to show you what parts you're good. Just to show you how to put it together. Okay, so you got the frame, everything. Alright, so here's the uh, here's everything we're gonna use. So uh it's, uh put it. So we're right now. I can get that. Hey uh, super time, sit down. Thank you. I forgot which one. And he's going to be taking the pedal off. Now, if you get like rusted bolts like this, it's such a pain in the ass. You may want to spray it with some WD-40 if you have some. But don't use that in the crank because you will eat the bearings alive. I found that fact out for my 2009 Harrow, which I totally messed up. Okay, it's almost off. Hey, pass me that uh, big thing right there. I'll take hold, hold that real quick. The right pedal is off to the left. Okay, this loose. Oh, tightening it. <laughs> and we're taking it off right here. Got about to slip in. Need to pop that off. Put mm -hmm. a wash right here. Okay, Thomas Moore. Super Thomas Moore, take that off. Now he's using a flat screwdriver that. But since I don't like those big ones, you can use the big ones or small ones for optional reasons or. They do sell special tools like this, but since I don't have that money right now, as I speak, I'm going to be updating. Yeah, I'm good with that. You're in a weird angle. Yeah. Plus, I was tightening it, which that won't help. <laughs> now we are making another move on a video. We're going to after this that we're going to show you how to reassemble. And on another frame because we only get a certain amount of minutes with these cameras so yeah which is probably going to be this one right here rocket machine magnet not a great thing. frame but you know we'll get the job done from point a to b and once you take these brackets off there's these bearings in here that just, just shake it up there i'll show you what those look like Bearings look like this. Do not spray these with any type of WD-40 or they will totally blow up and that is not easy to change. Well not blow up but it will eat away the grease and may uh, cause a little friction make it a little rough to drive. Here's the crank with the pedal still on it. Okay. Which note you do not have to take that pedal off. You can only take the right one off if you want to take the crank off. So okay, hold the bike on the proper chain. This bike does not have a master link, so I already popped it off, but it's very easy. You just take a screwdriver wedging in here, and then you hit it with a hammer, and then this part will just come down. Very simple. If you have any questions about it, I'll show you in another video how to, to take it apart later on. Or if he doesn't, I'll show you. Um...